I just landed in Johannesburg. It was a long, long flight, 21 hours, but I'm finally here. <laughs> That's my driver, you all. He's saying, what's up? <laughs> Tell me your name. What's up? My name is Doctor. What's it, what's it, what's it, what's it, what's it, what's it? Yo. I'm so goofy. So anyway, this is day two here in Johannesburg. I actually got here yesterday, but I slept all day because I had to take two flights. So I had to fly from Los Angeles to London, which was 10 hours. And then I had to fly from London to Johannesburg, South Africa, which was 11 hours. So I was literally on the plane for almost an entire day traveling. So when I got here um, yesterday morning, like I took a shower, ordered room service, and I slept all day long. It still really hasn't hit me that I'm here yet. It's currently like 3.30 a.m. and I have to be in an Uber at 4 a.m. I'm gonna go about an hour away outside of Johannesburg to this lodge where I have to meet this group of people and they're gonna take us somewhere and then we're gonna get on a hot air balloon. I'm gonna vlog the entire experience. I think with this particular travel vlog, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to make individual videos. I'm gonna make like three or four videos instead of what I usually do, which is I usually try to pack everything into one video. So I think since I'm gonna be here in Johannesburg for an entire week that I need to make more than one video. That's what I'm gonna do, y'all, all right? So by the time you all see this video, I will have already got on the hot air balloon like, praying because believe it or not, I know some of y'all think that I'm like, like a daredevil or spontaneous, but I'm really like a laid back kind of person. So this is really adventurous for me to be all the way on the other side of the world in South Africa by myself about to get on a hot air balloon. I'm like, nigga, what the fuck are you thinking? <laughs> So far since I've been here, everybody has been so nice, so hospitable. Um, when I first landed, I wish I would have took some footage, but I'm gonna get some footage maybe tomorrow because I'm gonna have a, uh, another excursion. I'm gonna go on a safari. Johannesburg reminds me, it was only 20 minutes from the airport to my hotel, but it looked like the American South. It really reminded me of Atlanta, but it's really built up and civilized. And you probably would not expect that in Africa, but they do say that South Africa is the most developed country in Africa. And now I understand why. For my blabbing, I am about to head downstairs and jump in an Uber so that I can do the hot air balloon experience. All right, deuces, you. Yeah. Going that side. <laughs> do you know how to get there? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> you just said airport. I'm like, no, I'm not going back to the airport. <laughs> you got your emergencies on still. Pardon? You got your emergencies on still. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you got your emergencies on? Pardon? Your emergencies. Oh, like, oh sorry. <laughs> You're saying that we cannot stop at red lights because we can get robbed. Yeah, we can get robbed, yeah. Wow, is it common? Yeah, people like, many people like, uh, they hijack them by the robots. Uh, they can hijack you, yeah. <laughs> With uh, machine guns? Yeah. Wow. So you have to be like, if you're approaching a robot, you have to be alert because Okay, so you all, he's saying like, you see how you're approaching these red lights right here? It's yeah. like the middle of the morning. So what he's saying is that you cannot really stop at these red lights. Yeah. You have to like look and then you, you have to keep going. Go, yeah. Wow, because somebody might rob you. Wow, that's so crazy. <laughs> it's like dark as fuck. Like this is something out of a movie. Yeah. Like it literally is something out of a movie. Like it's crazy. You can't find, I think in America, you can't find a place like this, right? Uh. You, yeah, you can, but not in the city. Like, the city. you have to go far, far. <laughs> By the farms. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you all, I just made it to the lodge. My driver is pulling away and we're going in. Oh my goodness. This is something out of a scary movie, I swear you all. And so I'm gonna go in here and we're going to check in for the hot air balloons.
So y'all, I'm sitting here in the lodge waiting for other people to arrive because I'm the only one in here. So I'm about to get on the hot air balloon. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sitting here at the lodge right now, and I met these two lovely individuals. Can you tell us your name? My name's Yolo. Yolo. And your name? Matado. Matado. And they are, they've been just vibing with me. We've been chilling. It's been like a really good conversation. And so, um, these two, along with the rest of the individuals here, they're going to get on the hot air balloon with me this morning. So, yeah, we've just been vibing, y'all. <laughs> okay. So you all, we are getting on the van that's going to take us to the balloons, you all. From a company called Cameron. Uh, you don't get a, a balloon manufacturing company. So you all, we are pulling up to the hot air balloons. So just for interest sake, our balloons do. Y'all, I cannot believe that I'm about to get on a hot air balloon. Can you believe that? <laughs> Single.